Alrighty guys, so right quick before we up on today's video, we are actually on Ethereal doing a From Scratch series, so this is going to be very, very OP. Super excited about this as well. This server looks actually so amazing. I did a uh, video here, but it's been some time. But I've seen a lot of updates recently, and I'm like, yo, I haven't played an old school server on a From Scratch in a minute. So why not try it out here on Ethereal? And I might do it like a live stream series as well. So if you guys see me live here on Ethereal, make sure and tune in. So right now, go ahead and be notified. And with that being said, we're also going to be doing a giveaway for an Arzinian bow or a sword or a staff. I'll let you guys decide, but I'm actually going to decide for you because I'll take one of these out of your way. I'm going to be using the Arzinian bow for this series. Now my series for this is actually to get to very in-game, be able to kill like all the in-game bosses, do all the skilling stuff, etc, etc. Now you can see the bonuses for these weapons as well. So if you actually win today, you're going to get hooked up. Very, very nice. 20% damage and accuracy boost against your current Slayer task. And then it also deals an attack with 100% increase of accuracy and damage as well in your Slayer task. So these are going to be freaking ideal for Slayer, which is what I'll be doing most in this series as well to try to reach in game. But yeah, guys, big giveaway. If you want to enter, make sure and like the video, comment down below your ETH or IGN, and of course, subscribe to the channel. The first comment today is also going to receive a $10 bond, so make sure and be notified, guys. But yo, I would love to see people come and check out this saver. It's truly a very clean, old-school saver and a lot of content. I actually don't know too much about the game. I'm actually kind of hopping into this, like, you know, blinded. But I play old-school, I play RuneScape. And I think we can figure this out. I don't play much old school anymore, but I, I want to play a lot more old school. We'll put it that way. So we're going to learn here, and I hope you guys enjoy this series. Sit back, relax, and let's hop into the grind. Alright, so the grind begins, boys. We are starting a fresh account on Ethereal. Obviously, I'm going range route because I want that Arzinian bow as my main grind weapon for this series. We also got a starter lockbox here, which I can open real quick and see what we can get. Got an RM Staff Crystal Bow. Amulet of uh, Fury or an Abyss Whip. Obviously, uh, actually, since we're going for the art, I don't know. Do I go Crystal Bow or Fury? Ah, uh, it could be a harsh decision, but I'm gonna go Amulet of Fury. Why not, dude? That is our first bonus to the account. Anyway, I love these graphics, by the way. This saver looks very sick. I'm actually excited for this place. But yeah, the first thing we're going to do is colon colon vote. I promise we're not forcing you. We got ourselves an enhanced crystal key, five vote tickets, and some snow tokens as well. Also an achievement point. So that's quite sick. Good luck to me, dudes. Come on now. Starting off 53 dragon darts, dude. 150k. 28 super restores, which is quite OP. I will take that all day. They have a fully freaking customized Sandcrab Zone at home. Their entire home area is so cool. Like, there's so much stuff around it. So when you guys log in, definitely take your stroll around the home area. But yeah, we need 75 range for this Arzinian bow. So we're going to get this up real quick. Hopefully knock this out quite soon. Stats seem to be going up fairly quick, which is good. I want to get these out, like... ASAP so I can get onto the big boy grind. Slayer and etc. Obviously a must is colon colon refer. And then we gotta type right you. Let's walk away from the sand crab real quick. We got 50 range already. That's so quick. Alright, let's type right you and watch the inventory. Bang. Look at that. Three more crystal keys. We got a 50% bonus XP scroll and a drop rate potion. That's why this is fucking ideal, bro. That's why this is ideal. You you must use that. All right, now we actually got to see what we get out of these as well. Come on. Hopefully we get something decent. We got freaking three crystal keys. Hey, yo, I'll take that all day. Yo, 51 dragon bones. That's OP, bro. 39 lava dragon bones, bro. Holy crap, that's so ideal, bro. All right, we're going to pop this bonus XP scroll, use these bones, and yeah, we should get prayer out of the way quite quick. Let's go. That's an OP little uh, starter. By the way, we can actually use this starter lockbox in 24 hours again and get another reward. It's like the crystal bow, all the other items I will be able to get in like four days. I will be able to have like all them items. That's sick, dude. It's definitely a nice little starter lockbox you get when you log in as well. Now, of course, the donator zone, you get more experience doing skilling. Literally, they have an altar here as well. So we're going to throw these right now. Um, RC crafting here as well. That's fucking sick, dude. All right. So the chaos altar is right here. Let's go ahead and toss these. Look at that XP rate. Definitely, I was going to like 20-something K before, so we definitely get more XP. 
and first inventory. We're about to be at 70 something prayer and one inventory. Yo, let's go. Another skilling achievement updated. And yo, the sword I'm using, by the way, is best in slot for the Slayer. So this is going to be very good for this little grind. They have an effect much like the Slayer helmet as well. So all those bones just gave me 88 prayer. That is so OP. We're fucking almost maxed in prayer like that quick. So that's that's lovely. Again, definitely use the donator zone for your skilling and everything pr practically. If you're a donator, you'll get more XP, etc, etc. Before we hop into the grind though, more grinds anyways, we're going to actually buy some stuff inside of the shops real quick. Upgrade our gears, etc. Let's do it. I got five vote tickets in my vote and I can buy some stuff in here. I could buy a key for five tickets, but I could save these and um, buy some stuff down the road. There's some like really OP stuff in here, dude. Super ideal upgrades inside here. Um, I, I know it's a terrible decision. But I don't know, bro. I just like these crystal keys right now. I want some more crystal keys. Let's go. Good luck to me. Oh, uh, okay. Hey, look at that. Another starter diary updated. Feels good. We got three achievement points. We got some coins as well, which I needed, bro. I needed them coins. 50 vote tickets. But since I'm a legend and I know you want to watch me from scratch, I'm not going to do it, bro. I'm just not going to do it. I love you guys. This is from scratch. From scratch. I'm not going to accept any donations. Nothing like that. I'll, ex I'll say that now. I'm not going to accept anything. We're going to do this from scratch. And we're going to be a freaking god. Alright, well, let's do it. We just received a dark relic as well. Dude, this looks sick. We can use it on a skill. Which skill? Let's, I'm thinking Slayer. I'm really thinking Slayer. How much does it give? <laughs> 8 Slayer. Let's freaking go, dude. 75 range obtained. Look at that beauty. How OP is this versus sand crabs, by the way? Yo, it's fast as well. It's a fast weapon. Super freaking OP. This is going to be OP. All right, so we're going to actually hop in a Slayer right now. Now it is time to begin the Slayer grind. GG sand crabs. My first Slayer task with this beautiful bow is 24 spiders. We got ourselves a vote boss appearing and we're going to try to get lucky. I swear the graphics on this game are so clean. Love it. Let's see if we get lucky though. A football's uh, drop would be ideal for starting out. And look at that. We got a, another starter diary completed. We got five magic note paper as well. So I will take that. Let's go. What are this, what's the magic note paper for? I'm going to figure. Oh, actually, I'm pretty sure that's like you can use items on it. Like watch. And I can note it. That's so ideal to have. Magic note paper. That's actually lovely, dude. This man just pulled a crystal body from the Elven crystal chest. That just shows you. You can get crazy rewards out of there. I did not expect that, so that's super nice to know. I'll be going for those for sure, especially with this dude. Crystal set with this freaking Artisanian bow. Hell yeah, that'd be sick. All right, Slayer's actually going up quite quick as well. We're at 28 Slayer, so yeah. Bird Slayer task complete. Don't mind if I do. We got five more brimstone keys, so I need to go use these as well. So here we go. We're actually mining some stardust. This bad boy just appeared by the Verdock mine. So yeah, we're gonna grind some stardust and of course some skills. Bird is skilling of the account. Already 40 mining as well. This thing gives you crazy XP. There we freaking go. We mined that bad boy. We got almost 400 stardust as well. And look at all this stuff we can buy. Bag full of gems, celestial ring. I'm gonna save for that. We have 400 and look at, and look what this thing does. It, it shows nothing. And I don't know if it does nothing, but I'm definitely going to save for now and I'll probably go for that because I would assume it's good. Maybe for like mining or something, but yeah. All right. We got ourselves other skilling supplies as well and 400 stardust. Also 73 mining. I will take that all day. So with the Slayer VIP ticket, what you get from like just random task. I got it randomly on my last task. You can actually choose between a uh, task you want, but it does cost the Slayer VIP ticket. I'm actually gonna do, I don't know, like they're kind of the same, right? Like nothing too different. I guess I'll rip it for the fuck of it. We got 42 lesser demons. My main goal right now is to get this Slayer ring, which will teleport us to our Slayer task. It costs 75 points, so we need to complete quite a few, but that is definitely an item I want. But there's also like extend tasks, you can unlock stuff. Definitely will be looking at some of this stuff later on, because this is all gonna help me out quite a bit. There's a lot of stuff to buy. We got VS Sword, we got Skeleton Lantern, 
and a lot of stuff. So yeah, I'll figure more out about Slayer as we go. We do have to sell five brimstone keys, so we're gonna open these bad boys and see if we get lucky. Hey, yo, what the heck? These are OP, dude. These are OP. Holy crap, bro. Iron Man, are you kidding me? Luck Enhancer, Artisanian. What is all this stuff? We got a Slayer Blessing as well. Bro, restore hit points and prayer by 10% upon killing your Slayer target. That is an ideal item to get. Yo, bro, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Those keys are sick, dude. Look at all that stuff. Now, if you're watching, wondering how you receive this bow here, you get it from the Arzinian Dungeon Teleport. So if you go to Dungeons, then the Arzinian Dungeon, you can attack those NPCs in there and hopefully get yourself your best in slot Slayer Bow or Staff or, of course, your sword, whatever you want. But yeah, that's definitely how you get it, guys. Go down to your teleports, go to Dungeons, then the Arzinian Dungeon right there. And that is how you guys can work toward this best in slot Slayer Weapon. Another Slayer task complete, earning 30 points. We got 10 for the first one. We got freaking 30 for that one. We are actually on a task streak now. 53 Gordax is the next task. Keep in mind you guys can AFK right here, which is just super chill. You just AFK. Simple as that. Just like that. And you can actually buy stuff inside this AFK token shop. If you're a cosmetic guy, quite sick. There's the Easter basket, sled. And I'm pretty sure there it is gambling on Etheril. So that'll be something you might be watching down the line on this grind. Maybe some gambling after I get some like cosmetics, look like a beast and get short in game. These Gordax hit quite hard, but we are clapping them out as well. And yeah, I want to show you guys the achievements real quick because that's something everybody wants to do when you start. You can get some extra stuff in the achievements, but there we go. 600k cash. There's also perks here you guys want to check out. You guys can like enable, disable perks. Right, let's go over here and show you all this real quick. I don't want you to be like confused. Like what do I do, you know? I'm gonna show you guys real quick. So you got all these perks here. You guys can actually uh, enable once you get the right stuff for it. Obtain through donating or tournament points. It'll tell you exactly what to do. And you can actually get these perks that'll actually add a lot of bonuses to your accounts. PVMing, skilling, activity perks. There it is everything here for you. The voting perk, enhanced crystal keys from voting are 20% more lucky, likely. That's OP, dude. Then of course the achievements, easy, medium, are gonna be ideal for you brand new players. Like that right there, boys. Already got one out of the way. And yeah, we get rewards for these as well. So you see you get like five brimstone keys. Each one we complete, we'll be able to get like skilling points and different stuff to help us out. So definitely check this up. This will actually help you out a lot. And a lot of new players are gonna do this for the grind. So let's go. I am working on this right now as well, so I'll uh, go through these as we continue this grind more. But yeah, definitely check this out if you're new. I got a brimstone key as I teleport away from the task. Yo, let's go back real quick. Let's see if I can actually get this back real quick. D, I, and let's put R here to get a Gordax. I love this little fairy ring. It took me a minute to like know what it was used for, but now that I know, very not very ideal. All right, we got the brimstone key. I I was so salty thinking I just lost that bad boy. All right, there we go. Key obtained. Feels good. Good luck to me. Boom. Unfortunately, nothing crazy. I'll take the supplies though. These are what my stats look like right now: 76 Slayer, 92 range, 45 defense, 81 hit points, 73 mining, and 88 prayer. Actually, not bad. Obviously. The Slayer grind is what we are hopping into and going to be doing a lot of. So yeah, this bow is freaking OP. Literally amazing stats, amazing bonuses for it as well. It's best in slot for the Slayer. So having this will definitely help us get to end game. And as you guys can see throughout the grind, we got a lot of snow tokens. I have more in the bank, but I just want to show you what we can get inside the shop. Lots of stuff. Obviously loads of tokens to claim this stuff. But you get them doing practically any activity in game, PVM skilling, you you claim these. So yeah, this is OP. It's definitely something I will try to get later down the road. But yeah, guys, that's wrapping it up for episode one. I will see y'all with episode two of Rodan Game on Ethereal very soon. The links are down below. Make sure and join, and I'll see you all in game and very soon.